What's going on you guys? It is Wanny back on your screen bringing a brand new video in Greenville, Wisconsin. If you're new here, make sure to smash the subscribe button down below to join the Wanny family today. And today we are going to be headed to work at the police station. So let's get going right now. My boss said there's a very important meeting that we need to get going to right now, you guys. So we're going to be getting on the road in just a second and we are going to be headed to the station immediately guys i'm a little bit nervous because my boss did not sound happy this morning so hopefully everything is okay and we still have a job you guys you just never know what to expect because our boss sometimes gets really really angry with the officers because some people in the town are not following the laws and we need to fix it you guys so you just never know what we need to work on until we get there but hopefully everything is okay and our team can manage to fix it so we'll be around in just a few more seconds luckily we live so close to work it is such a nice morning commute so we're gonna be here in just a moment and we are going to be getting ready for this meeting you guys all right here we are right now let's head inside and let's go to the meeting I believe it is going to be held in the library this morning oh seems like everyone's here hi everybody how are we doing today I am here for the morning meeting come on everybody let's have a seat here and let's see what the boss has to say this morning all right, guys, I'm a little bit scared. You just never know what the boss is going to say. All right, guys, let's see. Hi, everybody. Make sure to be on the lookout for people parking illegally. If you need anything, let me know. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, there has been a lot of people parking their vehicles throughout the town without paying the meters. Um, they have been leaving vehicles fully abandoned. And this has been happening throughout the town. So we got to make sure that we catch all these vehicles and we get them towed immediately. Okay, because it is not a good look for our town and people are just leaving these vehicles everywhere. It is just unbelievable. All right, guys, let's get on the road right now and let's get going to make sure that everybody's following the law and paying for those meters. Come on, let's go, let's go. Boss, you're going to be joining me today because I know your car is in the shop. So let's get going right now and let's get on the road, you guys. We have our CAD system, which lets us know when people report anything um, on our computer system. So... Um, it seems like there's an altercation at the burger house right now. We have a couple people arguing We're gonna head down to the burger house first see what is going on and hopefully we can resolve the situation because the owner of the restaurant was called very distressed and he said to get down here as soon as possible apparently burgers are flying and people are very very upset so we're gonna get over there as soon as we can and we are going to make sure that this situation is handled you guys i'm a little bit worried hopefully everything is okay and we can manage this i know it is not sounding good at all i mean we were speaking to the owner he's starting to cry a little bit so hopefully he can keep it together and the restaurant is not totally destroyed by the time we get there so let's turn on our siren and let's let people know that we need to get there as soon as possible guys we are literally roaring on the road as fast as we can but this Chevy is not the quickest vehicle on the road. We might have to upgrade to like the Chevy SS model because this thing is not that fast of a police vehicle, especially when you are like in a high speed chase. So we're pulling up to the burger house right now. We're going to find out what is happening and hopefully we can defuse the situation and get everything handled. All right. Luckily, we have our boss here today because this would have been crazy without him. All right. Here we are. Here we are. Oh, looks like the owner is outside right now. Hi there, sir. Is everything okay in here? Help me! People are throwing burgers everywhere and there's drinks all over the floor. I need help right now. Do not worry. Do not worry. We're going to handle this situation. Excuse me! Excuse me! Uh, what in the world? Excuse me! What are you doing? Uh, sir, stop right there, okay? Sir, stop right there. If you do not stop right now, we will put you both under arrest immediately, okay? I need everyone to calm down. Sir, I need to speak with you outside, okay? Right this way, right this way. Sir, right over here. I'm gonna speak with you outside about what is happening. We're gonna defuse the situation, okay, sir? Um, is there anything that we could do to help you out here? I know you really want your dollar off your meal, okay? But it is not that big of a deal, okay? So you need to stop throwing french fries and burgers all over the place because as you can see, the owner of the restaurant's very upset and you know we are gonna have to ask you to leave the premises if you do not leave the property um we will trespass you and you'll be banned from burger house for 35 years okay so it is your choice to a leave the property or b be banned from burger house for 35 years so what's your decision okay what's your decision what would you like to do all right so you'll be leaving the property thank you very much all right so get on the road. Thank you very much. All right, I got to speak with the other person that was throwing stuff everywhere. 
Excuse me, sir. I need to speak with you outside, please. Right this way. Right this way. Everyone else, please stop recording. This is nothing to be on YouTube or TikTok. Thank you very much. All right. Um, I am so sorry. Uh, sir, we have reports of you causing a scene here at the restaurant. Unfortunately, we're going to have to A, either ban you from the restaurant for 35 years, or B, um, you'll be trespassed from the property, or C, um, you need to leave. So what is your choice? Oh my gosh, she's running away. Well, good choice, sir. Thank you very much. Makes my day a lot easier. Thank you. Oh my goodness, sir. I am so sorry about that behavior. Thank you for letting us know. I know people have been getting a little bit agitated about, you know, fast food, which is very crazy. I can't believe people get this upset about fast food. But, you know, I think we handled it pretty well, sir. Unfortunately, you're going to have to clean up the burgers and the soda all over the floor. But I think it would be best to shut down the restaurant for a while, okay? So just close it down for a couple hours, get it cleaned up, and, you know, we're going to get the area cleaned up, okay? All right, everyone, uh, the restaurant is currently closed, so we need everybody to leave. Thank you very much, guys. Unfortunately, restaurant is closed. Thank you, guys. You'll have to come back at another time, sir, okay? All right, guys, we are going to have to close off the doors right here. They are completely closed right now, and they will be reopening in about two hours, you guys. So what a crazy day. Good job, deputies. We are proud of you. Great job, everybody. I mean, that was great teamwork. Honestly, I was a little bit stressed about coming here, but we did a good job, okay? All right, well, let's get back on the road, you guys. Let's get back on the road. Honestly, we need to get going. Uh, that's enough police state. Thank you very much. Uh, guys, I have another call coming in. We got another call here from another restaurant in the town, you guys. We're going to get on the road immediately. Um, this is not good. We have another call. It is headed to the twist. Oh my goodness, guys. Apparently, there are abandoned vehicles at the twist that we need to handle. This is what our boss wanted us to take care of. So we're taking the back roads right here. Apparently, we have two vehicles that are literally abandoned. Um, they have been sitting at the twist for approximately two weeks. There's literally spider webs all over the vehicle, and it is leaking oil, you guys. So apparently, it is like a purple like convertible, and they didn't really say about the other model. So We'll figure it out when we get there, you guys. So we're going to turn on our sirens and we're going to get down there because, you know, the owner of the restaurant is getting a little bit mad. He's saying it's taking up parking spots. Even though it is not a busy time of the day, it gets very busy at the twist after dinner because everyone wants their ice cream, you guys. So we're going to head down there immediately and we are going to get these vehicles towed as soon as possible. And as you guys know, they have parking meters at the twist. If you want to park there and go walk somewhere, you have to pay. These vehicles have not paid in days, you guys. So they are illegally parked and they are going to be handled very, very quickly. So here we are right now, you guys. Um, we are pulling up to the twist and we are finally here you guys. All right, here we go everybody. Here we go everybody All right, here we are here. We are all right. Let's talk with the owner. Hi there. How are we doing today, ma'am? Um, we are here about the vehicles that were abandoned um, It seems like that convertible that left that you called in on but it seems like there's a Mercedes out here that you want towed Okay, we'll get that thing out of your way and we will get it towed. Okay. All right here we are. All right. Uh, here's the abandoned vehicle right over here. Uh, can you get this thing on the tow bed immediately? This thing has been sitting here for days. It literally has spider webs growing on it. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. I need you to step step back, please. We're going to be towing this vehicle. Thank you very much. We're going to be towing this thing, okay? Step back, ma'am. Step back. Thank you very much. Ma'am, I, I need you to step back. I understand that you're upset, but this vehicle has been um, here for days, okay? Oh, my goodness. Ma'am, ma'am, calm down. Oh my goodness, guys, this is not good. Uh, she is not, she's not following police orders. Ma'am, I need you to calm down. There's no reason to shout and scream, okay? Thank you very much. All right, as you guys can see, we're getting this thing on the tow bed immediately, and we're going to get this thing to the tow yard where it belongs until the owner can get it out of the impound. All right, here we go, everybody. All right, we're going to give a police escort to the tow yard, and then we are going to see if we have any more calls for the day. As you guys can see, it has been a crazy, crazy day. All right, ma'am, we got that cleaned up for you. We're glad that it is out of your parking lot, and, you know, let us know if you need anything else, okay? Have a great rest of your day. We appreciate your business, and, you know, we love the twist very much, okay? All right, let's get going right now, you guys. Let's go. Here we go, everybody. We are going to be giving it the... Oh my gosh. This lady's running around like a maniac. Oh my goodness. As you guys can see, 
it is crazy here in Greenville, Wisconsin. We have a lot of reports of vehicles that are just being left in parking lots. And it is not a good look for our community, guys. It is definitely not a good look. So we're going to be getting this thing to the impound lot. And it is going to be there for quite a while until the owner could either pay for it or pick it up, you guys. So we'll be pulling up there in just a few minutes. As you guys can see, we are pulling up right now. And we are going to get this thing taken care of. And uh, seems like we have a random vehicle here, guys. What is this about? Uh, deputies, we got a vehicle out here right now. I'm not too sure what is happening. Excuse me. Stop the vehicle. Excuse me. Uh, this is police property. Uh, we need you to step out of the vehicle, please. Step out of the vehicle. Sir, what in the world are you doing? This is private police property. You cannot be driving here. What is this? We got two vehicles here. Excuse me. Stop the vehicle. He's doing a burnout. Oh, my gosh. He just hit an officer. Excuse me. Stop right there, sir. Oh, my goodness. Sir, stop right there. Hey. Oh, my goodness, guys. This is not good. Sir, stop right there. He's getting away. What in the world is happening right now? Oh, my goodness. Uh, we need 1032s here. We have a crazy blue Mustang. He just backed into my police vehicle. What in the world? Guys, what in the world is happening? Oh, my gosh. He just backed into my car again. Stop this guy. Guys, we need 1032s out here, right? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Out of the vehicle right now. We have two vehicles that are just driving like maniacs. Oh, my goodness. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, my goodness. Sir, stop right there. Sir, stop right there. This is police orders. Sir, stop immediately. Oh, my goodness. Sir, you are under arrest right now for... A, smashing into a police vehicle and driving recklessly down the road, okay? I have my body cam on right now. We did not even touch ya. Officers, get him in the back of the vehicle and get him to the station immediately. We have two suspects in custody for trespassing on police property. Uh, we need to get this Mercedes out of the road. Okay, back it up. Back up the tow truck right now. They need to get this Mercedes out of the middle of the road right now. I am so sorry. Um, this road is closed, so you're going to have to turn around your vehicle and go somewhere else because you cannot get through, okay? Thank you very much. As you guys can see, this Mercedes literally, literally smashed into our vehicle. It is destroyed. The bumper is hanging on by a thread. I mean, it is just not good at all, you guys. This thing is literally on the tow pad right now. All right. Uh... Boss, it seems like we got another call. We got another call. Apparently, there is abandoned vehicles at the Cats Park. So, we better get down there right now. And we better handle this situation. Let's go right now, you guys. This is just unbelievable. We are roaring down the road right now, you guys. Um, we have another abandoned vehicle. And we are going to have to handle this situation, you guys. This is just crazy. Vehicle after vehicle is being left throughout the town, you guys. We just do not know what to say. Apparently, a lot of people have just been not really caring about their vehicles and just leaving them everywhere, not paying their parking meters, which is unbelievable, you guys. I really can't believe it. So we're going to handle it, and we will get these vehicles towed as soon as we find them. All right, guys. Here we are. We're pulling up to Cats Park right now, and we are going to find out what's happening here. It is about $2 per hour here to park here at Cats Park. People have been parking here for months and months. We finally have the resources to bust these people and take their vehicles into the impound lot. All right, guys, here we are. Here we are. All right, here we go. This Lincoln has been parked here for months. All right, uh, we need the tow truck here at the Cats Park immediately. Thank you very much. It is license plate Hawaii with Lincoln plates, you guys. Uh, we're going to have to get this thing towed immediately, okay? All right, we got backup pulling up right now, you guys. We got the tow truck pulling up right now. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is just crazy. It's literally a green Lincoln. I've never seen something like this in my entire life. We're going to get this thing towed as soon as possible. And we are going to get it to the tow yard immediately, you guys. We got the tow truck right over here. Uh, I need everybody to step back, please. Everybody step back immediately. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Everybody needs to step back. This is a police order. Thank you, everybody. All right, get this thing on the tow bat as soon as possible. All right? You might have to back up this thing, okay? All right, guys, here we go. They're going to back it up. Hopefully, they could get this thing on the tow truck and get it to the tow yard before the owner finds it, you guys. Oftentimes, we got to get these things towed before the owner comes because they will get very, very mad and they literally will 
um, scream and shout at us and it'll be a crazy crazy disaster so we're gonna get this thing on the tow bed right now as you guys can see this SUV is literally gigantic very very difficult to tow all right here we go we're getting it on there right now careful careful you break it you buy it you break it you buy it. Uh, everybody no need to record no need to record okay it is literally just us towing a vehicle no need to record everybody thank you very much all right here we go Finally, they got it on the tow bed right now, you guys. As you guys can see, everyone is literally standing here recording us. It is stressful. This job is crazy, you guys. All right, here we go. Get it on the tow bed. Get it on the tow bed, you guys. Guys, stop the recordings right now. Thank you very much for following police orders. We appreciate it very much. All right, everybody. Well, we are going to be getting back on the road right now. We're going to be headed back to the police station. We are going to be clocking out for the day. I mean, it has been an unbelievably busy, busy day. I honestly cannot believe it because we have just been working all day long. We have no time for even a lunch break or a dinner break or even a snack break, you guys. We have been working nonstop since we have clocked in this morning, you guys. So what a day. Hopefully our boss is happy that we're able to get many vehicles back to the impound yard and we were able to handle many, many different situations throughout the day, you guys. So what a crazy day it has been, you guys. Hopefully our boss is happy that we got all these vehicles to the junkyard or to the impound lot, which is great news because apparently news reporters have been reporting about 500 abandoned vehicles every single day here in Greenville, Wisconsin, which is crazy, guys. It is just crazy. So what a day we have had. I am honestly exhausted, so we are going to get back to the station, clock out, and go home and rest for the entire evening, you guys. What a day. Thank you so much to our boss for joining us today. Boss, you really helped save the day. You really did. So we're super, super thankful for you, and we appreciate all of your help. So let's get back inside the station right now, clock out for the rest of the evening, and get ready to head home, you guys. Seriously, here we go. Going to head to the office right now. Um, it is 7.20 p.m., and we are clocking out for the evening. So thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure you guys smash the like button. Leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe to join the Wanny family today. Thanks so much for watching. If you made it to the end of the video, you are awesome and we will see you in the next one. Bye everybody.